Pee-pee. Did you go pee-pee? Okay. I love this because I feel like he's starting to like get this as a routine. Okay, let's see. Day 11. <gasps> what is this? Oh, it's big. Look at it. Show them first. Wow. It looks like a cheese ball. <laughs> he doesn't know how to make of anything. Crunchy. More ASMR for the Vlogmas fam. Well, good morning, you guys. Happy Vlogmas Day 12. We are 12 days from my birthday, turning 31, which is weird. <laughs> Age is just a constructive time. I really don't care. I never, I think when I turned 30, I don't think I felt like, oh, my 20s. Like, I just, I think I'm just like, I love where my life is at. Does the number really mean anything? I don't think so. But anyway, let's make a coffee while I share what's on today's agenda. We're gonna go for our cute little gingerbread cup today. I'm sorry these are sold out. Okay, I'm just gonna like, I'm just gonna do it. I'm gonna try the new coffee creamer today and this could either go really good or really bad and we can always make a new coffee. I'm just gonna make like a little mini one. So I got this Nut Pods Zero Sugar, but it is sweetened with Stevia cookie butter. It's dairy free and I think I saw Emily Kaiser drink it. So we'll see how it is. Cause you guys know, I love my like sugar-free uh, coffee mate things. Um, I wanted to try to find a healthier one. I don't know. <laughs> uh, so we'll see, we'll see how it is. A lot of like the other ones are not sweetened. So I'm kind of curious. It smells good. We're just gonna do a little bit, like I said, and kind of just see how it is. Why is it chunky? Is it supposed to be chunky? Oh, is it, is it supposed to be chunky? Oh, I f maybe it's because it's almond milk and coconut milk. It's chunky. <laughs> it's not expired. Okay. Oh no, it's chunky. It's just the way it is, I guess. All right, as someone who drinks the really unhealthy sugar-free coffee mate creamer, I'm gonna be really honest about this. It's not horrible. I definitely do taste like a little bit of the coconut from the coconut um, cream. And I'm not a big coconut fan, but I do taste cookie butter. It's very subtle. It's not horrible. I feel like it's not like hitting like my regular coffee, but I don't hate it. I'm gonna let it simmer, but I am glad that my first initial reaction wasn't like, Ew. <laughs> so anyway, I am gonna drink this little rest and then I'm probably gonna make <laughs> my usual coffee as well. But um, on the agenda today, my mom and I are gonna go, so she has Mondays off. So we're gonna go to the mall, check out the Christmas decor, finish any Christmas shopping. She wants to buy me um, like birthday and Christmas gifts that like I like in store. That's kind of like what we've been doing the last few years. Like she likes to go to the store with me and see what I like and then, buy it and then wrap it up and give it to me for Christmas, um, which is super, super nice. Like I'm still so like heart warmed from her surprise that she gave me yesterday. Um, she really is the best. So we're gonna go to the mall. And also I figured, so this mall has, it's a restaurant in the food court called Kong Dog and it's like Korean corn dogs. And they're so good. We've gone with our friends a couple of times. They're so good. So my mom's never had a Korean corn dog. So I thought we could maybe have her try one in the food court. Cause like when I told her, she was like, what is it? Is it like, what makes it different from like just a corn dog? And I'm like, well, the inside can either be cheese. This place, it's either cheese or hot dog or whatever. And you can do half and half. You can do one or the other. And I told her, I was like, but the original has like cheese inside and then the outside has like sugar on it. And she's like, oh. So I was like, yeah, it's really different, but like the flavors just work and it's incredible. So I think we're gonna like get one of those and share it and do a little little taste test. And I wanna see if she likes it. Also, I would love to have one because I haven't had one in a while and it sounds so fire. So yeah, we're gonna go and have a little girl's day with my mom. So I'm gonna go get ready and then we're gonna hit the road. Okay, you guys, I just threw on really, really simple makeup. And then I'm wearing, this top is from Old Navy, getting into the holiday spirits. I love it, so cute. And then these are just some wide leg jeans from ASOS, they're old. And then I'm just wearing my 
platform Uggs because I feel like they go cute with like a wide leg pant situation. So let's go to the mall. Let's go see some Christmas decor. Also, <laughs> I have no hope for Yara's last gift that I have talked to customer support on twice. They keep saying they're doing a case and they're gonna let me know. I've gotten nothing. <laughs> so I might get him one more gift today at the mall that's tangible. Cause like that's the last thing I'm waiting for to wrap and I wanna wrap the presents. So <laughs> we'll see, we'll see if we can find anything. I'd kind of like to try to find um, what it was at the mall cause they should have it at a store, so. We'll see. All right, let's go pick up my mom and head to the mall. Okay, you guys, I'm driving to my mom's now. I've been in traffic for like at least 15 minutes. Oh, wow. And I just got to the area of the accident. Oh, goodness gracious. Oh my gosh. Oh, what? oh, the car is like in the middle of the road. Oh my gosh. It doesn't look like, it's just like part of the car though. No one looks, like no, there's no one here. I don't think anyone's hurt, but there's like a car in the middle of the whole freeway. And this is like one of the busiest highways. Wow. Okay, here's the other car. Okay, everyone looks okay, thank God. Phew, that's always really scary. But like someone did a little spin out in the middle of the highway. I always get so freaked out when I see like accidents and stuff. I'm like, I hope everyone's okay. It makes my heart like <laughs> squeeze up. Um, so I was like, I'm gonna vlog because I need to talk through this. Um, Yar is, Yar's working from home right now. So he and Bruni are back at home. It's just your girl, no Bruby. Um, so yeah, last night we, oh, last night. <laughs> so Yar and I do a thing where we well, we just recently started doing it. I mean, I feel like it's just like marriage in a nutshell. If we don't have a movie that we both want to watch, when it comes to shows, we both always, like, we make sure it's a show we both want to watch. Um, but when it comes to, like, movies, we have similar tastes, but then we have outside of our similar tastes, we have our own kind of things. Like, I'm here for, like, the romance or just like I like really corny comedies and then Yara likes a little like action I can do like action comedy vibes you know like there's a few I can't remember one with like Kevin Hart like I like a, I like a, I can do action if there's a little sprinkle of comedy so recently we've been doing like every other movie like we get to pick and like if 20 minutes in the other person can't stand it they're like I can't do this and then we shut it off but usually it ends up being like okay enough where we're like, yeah, I can watch this, like whatever. So last night Yar got to pick his movie and he, he decided to do Fast and Furious, like the original Fast and Furious. Um, so he wants to do those for his movies on his movie nights. And there's like 10 of them. So I'm about to watch all the Fast and Furious movies. So he puts it on <laughs> and I'm immediately just like, okay, this is so nostalgic the girl in it I don't know anyone's names one of the girls in it the Vin Diesel sister I did a panel with her I have a picture with her um, when we went when I did a panel with her for Zyrtec a really long time ago um, so I, I had met her and I hadn't seen Fast and Furious but like I, I knew of her um, oh my mom's calling Okay, naturally my mom just called me to ask what I'm wearing because that's just what us girlies do. Um, so the so that was the sister. I had met her in real life, which was really cool to finally watch the movie. And then the other girl, Vin Diesel character's sister in it, I recognized her immediately from one of my favorite movies, Blue Crush. I love Blue Crush so much, that surfer movie. I feel like it's from around the same time period. So it just had that same like nostalgic early 2000s vibe to it, which was um, kind of fun, you know? Cause like, although, you know, I don't really have the desire to watch Fast and Furious, um, about like five, 10 minutes in, I'm like, this is giving such nostalgic vibes. Like I will watch this. <laughs> I will watch the rest of this. Um, yeah, it was actually pretty good. It was pretty good. Um, it was like a little corny in some moments, but I think it was just kind it's kind of like just the way movies in the early 2000s were like, it just has that classic, like the same kind of music that like, da, 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 da. I'm, I'm not doing it right, but you know, it just, it has like that specific kind of 
genre vibe, the same kind of music, um, like the editing. Um, and it was just fun to see like all the clothes and the way everyone dressed and it just, I like he had a Von Dutch shirt on. It was just, it was just giving nostalgia. So I enjoyed it for that reason. So now I got to figure out what movie I'm going to do for my next one. And God knows it's probably going to be, um, a Christmas one. <laughs> uh, but yeah, guys, I can't believe it's already, the month is going by really fast. Like we're halfway to Christmas in December almost. And I still have a lot of movies that I need to watch. There's a Hallmark one I recorded over the weekend that I want to watch. Um, cause the, there was a guy in it from Jane the Virgin. <laughs> so I was like, oh, whenever I recognize an actor in like a Hallmark movie, I'm like, oh, I want to watch it. You know, like I, last year I was so excited cause I watched like the one where Jordan Sparks was in it. And I'm like, ah, Jordan Sparks, you know, I'm here to watch people that like I recognize. I find like, I find a good Hallmark movie cozy and easy to watch, relaxing. But then when there's someone in it that I actually like recognize, it's more fun. So I recorded that. I'll probably watch that on my own. I still haven't watched like the Home Alone movies. Um, I don't know. I have a lot I want to watch. So I also really want to watch the new Netflix one, Best Christmas Ever. I'm almost to my mom's, so I'm really excited to go to the mall. I love the mall at Christmas time. Look at your cute earrings. Thank you. Did you make them or they would they come like that? No, I got them this way. I got them, I don't know, some store list. Look at her cute Are we being oh, Hello. Hello. Yeah. Hello. <laughs> and she's got on her little cha cha and sweater. I have on my cha cha sweater. Perfect. We look cute. We actually we look like we're ready to do a little Christmas stuff. Bang. Yes. Did I tell you how I um one of Yara's presents? Like I'm waiting for one last present to wrap. No. So it said it I ordered it a month ago. Oh jeez. And every time I click on it it said UPS like label created but no movement mm. so i've contacted customer support like three times uh, for ups no for like the brand the place where you bought it yeah, yeah. and they keep saying they're gonna like open a case and like let me know um and try to figure it out but like i've gotten nothing like i don't know what to do anymore because every time i call them they're just like yeah what if you order another one yeah. and then when you finally get that one just return it? oh that's fair yeah that's true that's not a bad idea. Yeah, Christmas is two weeks away. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly two weeks. All right, we're off to the we mall. We are off. You know what, guys? Um, I think I've only been to the mall like once. I actually did go there once like ten, five years ago, ten years ago on a really bad date. Wait, I think I've been there twice on two really bad dates. <laughs> actually, yeah, you have. I can think of both of them. Oh, my goodness. So time to create You know what? Memories. I think my picker's off, though. I think I was always picking the wrong people. Yeah, is that the vibe? Yeah. Yeah. So I did tell you we're gonna try a Korean corn dog today. Yes, you did. And tell I'm me really that. excited because they're so good and they're so it's so different. Like you the get original. the traditional kind, right? Yeah. 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 And you say it's sprinkled in sugar. Yeah. And it's it's just cheese inside. The flavor is Wait, so, so it's fried cheese sprinkled in sugar? Yeah, pretty much. But it has like a coating. And it's a Korean corn dog. Yes. So we're gonna see if you like it. Okay. I'm curious. Okay, I'll take one bite of yours. Yeah. Awesome. I figured you'll get something else for lunch. Not Maybe. the green corn. Dog. Maybe. But I'm Fried excited. cheese, in sprinkled in sugar. It's really good. You know what? I might take a bite of yours and go, oh yeah, I need it. I need it. I really, really need it. So we're walking in the mall and naturally we look at everything all the time. Love this display. I still can't stop thinking about that coat in there. Like, you know, the pink one I have, but then that like bluish like, see how it has, like, the sheen? Oh, the sheen to it. I just love that. I wonder why you love I it. I don't know. It just does something. I think it's giving me nostalgia. It kind of gives, like, when I was a kid or something. Uh, oh, it's 40% off? Christmas? I have been wearing my pink one a lot. It's kind of been, like, my go-to coat. What's 40% off? I just don't need another coat. I have to, like, I know. reel it in here. I just, I don't know. There's something about it that I just love. It's so fun. It's like $32. $32. Yeah. That is solid. Okay, 35. 35. You know what? I'll think about it as we go through the mall because we're going to pass it on our way out. Okay. You were looking for it specifically? Yeah. Oh, online, right? Yeah. Oh my God, they have it. It's Yay. 40% off, mom. You got to get it. Oh my God. It's so cute. I can't believe they have it. We'll get it on the way out. Yay. And it's not itchy. That feels really soft. Yeah, it's not yeah. itchy. Oh, it's soft. Yes. Yay. That's so exciting. If you guys need a good uh, holiday outfit, Old Navy's the place. They've got really cute stuff. Don't you love this? 
Ooh, that's everything. Yeah, you and I love that. That's so cute. Probably on sale. I feel like everything in here is on sale. I still very much love this, but I just I just don't need it. Guys, all the clothes in Francesca's yeah, is 50% right off. I think they have a dressing room. I'll go try it oh, on. Perfect. Yeah. Is this like the Valentine's Day section? It's so cute. Guys, look, I kind of want to get this resting Grinch face because I have RBF really bad. And yeah, that's really cute. They have so much cute stuff. I love Francesca's. I really do. Oh my gosh. Mom, look what they have. A dog treat selfie clip so you can get like a perfect picture of your dog. Oh my god, that's insane. I want that. Oh, this is so cute. Very soft. Mom, what do you think? Is this too small? Because I think it actually looks really cute with even these jeans. Do you? It's wicked cute, right? I don't think it's too, no, too big. Yeah, it's just cropped. Actually, honestly, you've got like a ton of space in there. Isn't you it? It's so soft. I love it, right? I, I mean, it looks so good with these jeans. I oh love God. it. And then with that scarf, that scarf does not have pink and Yeah. <gasps> okay, all wow. right. Amazing, and 50% off. It looks so perfect with these jeans. It. Like, it hits right at the right spot. Hi, Sandy. Hi, <laughs> you guys are not gonna believe this. <laughs> we came to the mall, not just to shop, but for the Christmas vibes. The Christmas yeah, like I, I just need a little you know, like well, we want it like you come and you see the decorations. Oh my god, right? They don't have decorations oh, up. No decorations. Normally, when we come to the mall, they hang None. ornaments along the whole third floor because it's three There's open floors. Anywhere. There's no decorations. We've only seen like one deer on a bench. And There's Santa. and Santa, who is nice. That's it, though. Normally, they have a ton of decorations. I'm actually depressed about this but at least we're here on a monday so the whole mall is like pretty darn quiet Ooh, uh, i love this with the little pearl that's cute okay y'all headed up to get the corn dog first and foremost i'm just gonna get the classic for us to share and get mom's a first impression okay you guys we have the almighty classic cheese inside it's sugary Let's get your first impression well, while it's hot. Okay, and also let's just say I'd never even heard of a Korean corn dog. It's kind of, it kind of hit YouTube and the internet um, I don't a few YouTube. years ago. I don't go on the internet. Yeah, she doesn't know. I don't know. watch TikTok. I don't even know how to get to a TikTok. Yes. Have you guys seen these? I'm telling you. I'm sure y'all have seen these, right? Like I'm dying right now. <laughs> let's let's see if say. she gets a cheese pull. Oh, she got a oh, cheese. Oh <laughs> I love how she feeds into it for me. Oh my god. What are the first impressions of the Flav? Okay, love. Isn't it good? Yes, love. Okay, so number one, I love donuts. And the outside reminds yes. me of the donut. Yes. Number two, who doesn't love cheese? Yes. Oh my god. Isn't it good? Oh my god. Yeah, it's amazing. Best 10 out of 10? Oh, 10 for sure. Yay! Total 10. Many hours later. Okay, you guys, it is. 4:45, aka nighttime pitch black uh if you also get like dark early anxiety um i would recommend finding something that brings you joy and peace when it starts to get dark outside or making plans with someone or um just like embracing a good show so i was thinking about either starting my paint by numbers or watching some 90 Day Fiance, because that's like my comfort show. But Yara's finishing up work, and then I'm gonna make dinner. I'm gonna do um, something easy tonight. So I also had picked up groceries today. I just never showed putting it away. But I'm gonna make one of my favorites, KFC bowls. So I just grilled chicken, um, cut it up into pieces, and I cheated and got some pre-made <laughs> mashed potato at whole foods so i just like i said i grill up pieces of chicken season them really well mashed potato and then i do corn and a little bit of gravy and it's just so delicious it's just wholesome easy yummy wintry mm. so that's gonna be um for dinner tonight but it felt so good to take a shower get my hair washed put on my comfy clothes and i've been editing this vlog as well anytime you don't see me on here i'm usually editing what you're watching so i also am still trying to find the perfect spot for my mom's 
gift that she got me yesterday. I was going to put it on the kitchen windowsill, but it just, this uh, sink faucet blocks it just a little too much and I want it to be seen. So I'm still trying to find like the perfect spot for it. So eventually when I find it, I'll let you know where it is. Okay, cooking up dinner. I just cut up one and a half chicken breasts and I season them with adobo and then this everything but the elote. This has salt, so you don't need salt, but really yummy. I'm heating up gravy and I put a thing of corn in here with a little bit of butter and I'm just gonna heat up these mashed potatoes. Okay, here are our dinners. This is yours, this is mine. Mashed potato, chicken, corn, gravy, and then a sprinkle of cheese. But yeah, guys, that's gonna do it for Vlogmas Day 12, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.